Hey cord cutters, let's see how you use Sling on the Fire TV. We love Sling because it's reasonably priced and it has a lot of high quality programming that we know and love. So when we first log into Sling, the first thing we need to do is set up our favorite channels to make all this so much easier. So we come down, now we're gonna pick our favorite channels. I subscribe to Sling six months out of the year. Uh, because ESPN is what's uh, really important to us. So, and HDTV and the Food Network uh, are things my wife enjoys, but she doesn't need to have them year round. But we can always subscribe if something cool is happening, like uh, Lifetime Alive Project Runway. And uh, sometimes my wife will subscribe for, you know, two months for that. All right, so I'm going over to the guide real quick just to refresh the home page. When we come back to the home page, we're going to see all our favorite channels listed in a row right across the top. Super easy to navigate, read, see. You can select these. Or you could go over to the traditional grid guide. You can see I'm going over to the grid guide, and I can select the grid guide to display my favorite channels. It's a great way of customizing your experience. So we're gonna watch Ferris Bueller's Day Off. We just selected that, it's on AMC, which is one of my favorites. I've hit the up on the directional pad and that brings me to a quick guide that's great for surfing. I can select this show. It's commercial, I don't want to watch it, so I'm going to go flip around and do something else. We'll go watch The Office for a little bit. I hit the middle button, hit it again, I can go back to my previous channel. Great for watching sports. Here I'm going to record, I hit the middle button and then I go over to the left. I'm gonna record this episode only, it's a movie. But you can see it's got all the traditional recording options. I'm gonna bring up my quick guide again, I'm gonna surf around. Paranormal Survivor, not usually on my list of things to watch. But I've hit the middle button twice, and I'm going back to the Book of Eli, still a commercial. But I'm recording it, so I'll watch it later. If I go down, I can bring up the whole guide with all kinds of information, and then I can just hit the back button twice to go back. Here I am again, surfing around, and I'll select ESPN and see what's going on there.